the general staff of the armed forces informs the public that the terrorist attack launched against the security post of Ba and the shelling on Tombokao on the afternoon of Sunday, October 6, 2024, were repelled by the farmers. Thus, desperate attempts resulted in the neutralization of several terrorists, the destruction of their logistics, and the seizure of large quantities of drugs, of several weapons, heavy ammunition, and other communication equipment in their disbandment. The surviving assailants were chased and neutralized in turn by the farmers on the morning of Monday, October 7th. Surveillance made it possible to locate two columns of vehicles southeast of Dawa in the locality of the Tomoku. The first carrying armed terrorist was hit, leaving no chance to its occupants. The second vehicle carrying large quantities of ammunition was also successfully hit. The general staff of the armed forces reassures the population that the traces of large armed terrorist groups and the security operations will continue throughout the national territory. The youth of the Malian nation, you have to serve sentinel and it is from now on that you must to preserve our nation to make sacrifices that will not benefit after the advantages that other people will benefit it is normal you must accept certain things and you must refuse certain things that is what is about having principles because your future depends on the stability of the independent countries this is a good a good report coming from the Malian armed forces, how they were able to neutralize an attack on Sunday, sixth of October. No, yeah, sixth of October, and then the fight continued again Monday morning, seventh of October, and then again after all the, he the he went on to talk to the youths letting them know that their future depends on the stability of the country. They need to join hands to fight this fight and ensure that their territories finally recovered. I keep asking myself, is this war without end? Is it that these people, they keep neutralizing them, they keep re regrouping, when they neutralize this group, another group comes up. This is really a serious fight. It's a serious fight. It's, it's really not an easy one. So, like, what uh, the general staff of the armed forces have, have said, it's a collective fight. Like, he has called out the youths. It's a collective fight. There's something they need to join hands together. And then those that have been that are always easily and gullibly bought over should this time around be principled and say no, no to bad, no to bad offers. Protect the integrity of your country. Thank you again for your time with me. I don't take it for granted. Hope to see you in my next as I come your way again with more trending news. Bye.